What's up, everybody? It's Joe from Complex. We're in New York City at Flight Club with the new commissioner of SmackDown Live and WWE legend, Shane McMahon. Jordan 1s, the dunks, more of my thing, more what I grew up with. Gonna talk some sneakers today. We're also gonna talk some wrestling today, and then uh, hopefully he's gonna buy some sneakers. I got a lot of these. These are nice. Yeah. It's like a kid in a candy store. Ready to roll. Let's do it. So Shane, February, out of nowhere, you return back to WWE. Seven years, right? First of all, what was the moment like returning and getting that huge ovation? Something that rocked me. I mean, the Detroit audience was unbelievable. And it's one of those things I'll never forget in my life. For sneakerheads, what everyone noticed is that you return in the Chicago ones. I was wearing the J1s, uh, you know, I was wearing the Chicago's. Yeah. I just threw them, you know, I took them out of my closet and I just said, the return's happening, and it just was very organic, and I just put them in my bag, and I said, I'm just gonna wear these and rock a suit and come out, and we'll see what happens. When you were growing up, was it like this for you, or what? Uh, no, I mean, there wasn't that many styles. Yeah. Uh, you know, you go back, and really, the whole history of sneakers, I mean, it boomed, you know, uh, in the 80s. You know, DMC came out with the My Ideas, the whole song. The Air Force Ones came out 82-ish, somewhere around 81, yeah. 82. Yeah. And then the Jordans and the Dunks came out right around the same time. And I liked the fact that what Jordan was doing, and it uh, really related to me, mm -hmm. he was kind of the bad boy, if you will. Yeah. And that just resonated with me. So Shane, let's walk down here and talk about an infamous internet photo and a moment. You're passing some great shoes, though. You know that. We're we'll so come back to them. This, this was my closet at home. Yeah. Really? A lot of ones? Yeah. Well, uh, yeah. I'm, I'm partial to the ones. Yeah. But I think we're getting to your point when we're doing a little iconic three action. Exactly. So 2006 on Monday Night Raw. Oh, are these? Oh, yeah. Yeah. True blue threes. And you do your infamous off the top rope elbow. There's a Jordan dunk photo that exists from the foul line. This is your Jordan dunk oh, photo from the oh. foul line, essentially. You know, the cool thing about the threes um, that I liked um, compared to the ones, it was light years ahead from a uh, technology standpoint. Mm -hmm. um, and there's much more ankle support, and they were flat. Not knowing I was going to do it, but you know, I, from time to time, I obviously go up there, so I wanted something that was flat, balanced, and um, was just cool. In April for WrestleMania, 30s. You didn't get this one because yours was a one of one. Correct. But you got the black ones. Yeah, with your name on it. How long was that process to get that done? Was it a text message? Was it calling on the bat that's phone? All, that's all confidential. That's okay. all super all right. confidential. Does Vince have any classic pair of Jordans? No. None. No. Does he know that, oh, I wore a $2,000 pair of sneakers Monday? Would he even, would that even be on his radar? Uh, no. He, you know, he's. He's aware of the look. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he had the old school Stan Smith, you know, and that's coming back yep. retro. So totally. what's old is new again, but I'm talking he had them in, you know, 1970. Yeah, you know? <laughs> and now they're like one of the most popular sneakers. Uh, crazy. So Shane, we saw some classic Jordans. Let's go in the other room, which is a bunch of very valuable sneakers and also some historical sneakers. Talk about that. You go to the showcase? Let's do it. The toast of the sneaker game right now are Kanye signature sneakers, going for $5,000, the signature sneakers with Nike and Adidas. A WWE superstar that we talked about, John Cena, has his own signature sneaker with Kmart. You seem like you're more of a man of expensive taste, but would you ever wear John Cena's sneakers? Well, those are John's, so I'd probably want to wear my own, so. Okay. You know, if he, if he wanted me to, I'd say, yeah, sure. So you would support the home team? Well, he's the face that runs the place. He's on SmackDown Live, so yeah, whatever, whatever he needs done. But again, I'm more partial to the ones. We talked about Cena, but not just you wearing sneakers to wrestle in. We see the New Day in Jeremy Scott sneakers. We see Enzo Amore in a lot of Jordans. Do you feel yeah. threatened by Enzo's sneaker game or no, what? Not at all. You think yours is better? Way better. Cool. Yeah. Even my, my closet, Enzo will even say that. Really? Oh, he'd be like, oh man. You know, but Enzo wears some flashy stuff. Like he would wear these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you know that's not really my speed, but uh, you know, he's just out there and he's fun. But he's a, he's a good, good dude. Okay, fair. What do you think about sneakers going for $6,000? Um, Are you talking about Kanye? Yeah, um, what do you think? I like his music. Yeah. PC answer. Yeah, you like, like his music? I like his music. We kind of talked about everything. Now it's time for you to look around, shop, and uh, hopefully get some sneakers. I got a lot of these. These are nice. Yeah. It's like a kid in a candy store. These are Three cool. Three bears. These are cool. Kentuckys. Yeah. 
Eminem Jordans, $30,000. No way. Yeah. Well, Eminem can afford those sneakers. Yeah. I get it. So Shane, what are you thinking? I'm thinking I'm gonna go, I'm gonna grab a pair of these. Some good every day. Okay. Go with this one also, please. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, summertime, here we go. Nice. Got you. All right, moment of truth now. Your total is $871. So as you guys can see, Shane McMahon came through, stuck to his roots, four pair of Jordan 1s. Make sure you check him out every Tuesday, Smackdown Live, USA Network, 8 o'clock, and then of course, SummerSlam, later this month. Thanks for coming through, man. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. A lot of fun. Yeah, awesome.